Good morning, this is Gabriel Jackson, and welcome to BJC Allah Day number 1379. Allah Day keeps the Yetzirah away, and today we'd like to dedicate the Halacha in loving memory of Daniela Hampel, who unfortunately lost the battle to cancel yesterday, her Nisham Shavaliyah, and may her family be comforted among the other mourners of Zion and Jerusalem. Okay. We are continuing with the conditions whereby it is permitted to give work to a non-Jew on Friday. Very interesting. We said there's five conditions. We're up to condition number four. It is forbidden to stipulate with the non-Jew that he do the work on Shabbos. Even if you are not explicit about his doing it on Shabbos, but you set the time for the work to be completed shortly after Shabbos, and it is clearly impossible to complete the work by that time, unless it is done on Shabbos, this also is prohibited. Similarly, if you give him a letter and tell him, see to it that it is delivered there on such and such a day, and it is clearly impossible unless he travels on Shabbos, this too is prohibited. Likewise, if the market day is on Shabbos, sometimes the market day is only on Shabbos, it is forbidden to give a non-Jew money on Friday to buy something for you when you know that he can only buy it on Shabbos. Similarly, it is forbidden to give him something to sell for you under these conditions. However, the, uh, the, aforementioned, the aforementioned instance in which you did not specify that he do the work on Shabbos is only prohibited if you give the work to him on Erev Shabbos, meaning on Friday. But before then, like on Wednesday or Thursday, you may give him something to make or some money with which to make purchases. Now, there is a disagreement of what if, even if you give him the work on Wednesday, he for sure needs to do it on Shabbos. Is that a violation? So some say it's still fine, but others say that if you know he's, even if you gave him on Monday and he has to do the work on Shabbos to complete it, it would still be a problem. So ask your local Orthodox rabbi. It is. Best not to live in a city where the only market day is on Shabbos, for it is impossible to avoid violations. If the market is not in the Jewish neighborhood, there is no reason to worry. Now was your Thanks for listening. To sponsor Future Lacha or to be part of our new high club, click the link below, and we'll see you tomorrow.